I'm Gaines Richardson and I'm a palliative care specialist at Monroe Clinic. As a palliative care specialist, I'm granted unique access into many aspects of a patient's life that they may not have shared with other doctors and the time to really explore what's bothering people and then look for ways that we can help. In palliative care, we help our patients by first understanding what are the sources of their suffering because so much of medicine focuses on the physical, uh, the results of the lab tests or the x-rays. We really try to find what it is that's bothering the patient uh, or the family and we see what resources are available within the medical system, within the community to address those issues. And so for each person there's a unique set of problems and we try to bring whatever solutions we need to the table. I'd have to say that I'm most proud of my children. Uh, I was adopted myself and so I don't have any genetic relatives that I'm aware of and now that I've been blessed with three children it's been great to see some of the traits that I have come out in them and to just see them grow and be reminded of the things that I saw in my childhood that maybe I didn't necessarily see in my siblings. Some people might be surprised to know that I'm from Louisiana because they often are surprised I don't have much of an accent. Uh, I did a fair amount of traveling when I was growing up because my father was in the military but Louisiana was always home to me and my wife likes to joke she knows that when I'm on the telephone with my family because I start speaking with a southern accent. If I hadn't chosen medicine as a career, I think I would still be doing something where I was helping people. Uh, maybe uh, something in the ministry or uh, missionary perhaps. The hardest part of my job is that because I do deal with people that have advanced illness, uh, eventually they get to a point where the cures no longer work or attempts at life prolongation uh, simply aren't effective anymore. And it's very hard to lose those patients and I grieve with the families, but with the help of our team, uh, the chaplain, the social worker and the nurse, we all get through it together.